What's up, guys? We're hanging out in another closet confessional, this time featuring Amber Stevens, Hello. who you may know from ABC Family's hit show, Greek. Um, and by the looks of the, the closet, I don't think you're a far stretch from your character, Ashley. No, I'm really kind of into the fashion. Yeah, kind of into the fashion. <laughs> bit, I don't know, a like a little bit. So when you got the role of Ashley, it was probably like, oh, I can play this. Like, I got like, this. <laughs> no, you actually, from the very beginning, she wasn't really into fashion. It kind of was something that the costume designer uh, developed on her own because there were no other characters on the show that she could really have a lot of fun with fashion-wise, yeah. except for mine. And so she just kind of took it upon herself to kind of make Ashley like the fierce one who's like really into like random fashion yeah. and puts on like way too many accessories and stuff. How awesome are the shoes on set? Tell me about those. The thing is for me, unfortunately, I didn't have the greatest shoes really? on set because I'm so much taller, as you can tell, I'm <laughs> quite a tall person. Uh, I'm so much taller than a lot of the actors on the show. Yeah. So I was always in flats. So they were right. kind of cute, you know, but never really featured. It was more about like, you know, waist up and stuff. Got it. So um, my great shoe collection is only at home, not at set. Speaking of which, I think we should go check it out. Okay. Uh, amazing. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> so yeah, this is this is shoe rack number one. Yes. <laughs> Everyone kind of needs to have like like just the basic yeah, a stuff. New pump. But like stuff like this, I mean, what kind of amazing? Just like this is kind of like the new thing. I, I just like to collect things that are, you know, pretty high fashion. And I don't know. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> they're just really Heels. fun. Uh, obviously, platforms are kind of the best thing ever because they're wearable. Yeah. You know, and these are the most uncomfortable shoes that I own. Oh my god. Because they don't have any platform, but they have this amazing heel, so I just needed them anyway. And sometimes you have to suffer, right? Yeah, exactly. So, which ones are your favorite? Which are ones they are on my this rack favorite? or are they on the other rack? Um, I don't know. So many racks. So many I know shoes. there's so much to choose from. <laughs> yeah, let's go. Let's walk let's over walk to over. the <laughs> other side of the room. These are my first pair of like designer shoes. You can tell they're kind of old, but these are Marc Jacobs that I bought um, maybe maybe ten years ago. Are you or something? You're like fourteen. <laughs> I, yeah, I was like I was young, and I remember I lied to my mom. Oh really? And I was like, my friend bought me these shoes for my birthday. They're so amazing. They're these Marc Jacobs shoes. She did she find She might out? know now <laughs> that I actually spent my money and bought them for myself. But um, yeah, I, I kept that secret for a good, you know, at least five years. I think you just admitted. <laughs> yeah. So, like mom, it's... sorry, I lied. I bought them for myself. <laughs> sorry. It's okay. But I needed them. They were so cool. These are kind of one of my favorite pair. There's a designer um, pair of these that actually has five buckles on them, uh -huh. but they were like twelve hundred dollars, and yeah. I just couldn't justify that at yeah. all. And I found these online um, through like shoes.com and stuff. And they are, what are they, Mar they're Marciano. Yeah. And they were like, you know, a sixth of the price. Oh, I gotta show you these. Okay. So, they're, what are they called? Fiorentini and Baker. These are, they're, these are really popular. You've seen these, they're kind of a classic boot that a lot of people have. And they've been on the market forever. And I bought these a few years ago, and now you can find them everywhere. But the same company, obsessed with these shoes, <laughs> make these. Now, it's just an ankle boot, as you see here, but <laughs> it's also a knee-high boot. What you do, let me show oh you. Oh my gosh. They have these, like, I don't know what you call these things, but you can add them to the boot, and they end up looking like that. So they're, like, high <laughs> and all buckled up the side. I mean, they're just so okay. amazing, and I wear them all the time because I can, you know, dress them up or dress them down and they go great with like skirts and dresses but also you know if I want the military look I can wear them with like big coats and and jeans I'm just I'm obsessed with these shoes this is probably the best thing I ever bought oh and it's two in one it's like, a two in one too like, buy two shoes oh yeah it two was, shoes for price it one was, it was amazing so totally worth the purchase because I get a lot of use every day. okay question in what scenario would you be rocking <laughs> these um like a rave because no not no. <laughs> that I, you know, they look good on the shelf too. So they kind of just jazz up the room a little bit. Also, you know, you can wear them with just really, really basic, plain outfit. Yeah. You know, and then that's your jewelry. Like, don't wear anything but like black and that. You know, kind of keep it fun. So if someone at home, a diehard Ashley fan, wanted to steal your look, what Ooh. tips do you have for them? Well, my look or Ashley's look? Let's do the Amber look and the Ashley look, unless one they're one and the same. Um, they're definitely not one in the same. Ashley is a little bit 
crazier. And lots of accessories, lots of big boots, um, very colorful. And my personal fashion is a little bit more basic with like one little spark of something. Got cool. it. You know, like, so like, like let's the put, shoes. Let's say, like we picked <coughs> a pair of shoes, a shirt, like how would you put this all together? Ooh, should we put an outfit I together? I think we should put an outfit together. Okay, that's fun. Well, so we have these shoes, which are new. Fabulous. That kind of matches pretty fiercely. Quite. And um, maybe just some like leggings or jeans. I have, like, you know, obviously a lot of jeans. Or combined jeans and leggings, and you have jeggings. Jeggings or jeggings. <laughs> you know, that too. Those are it. <laughs> um, Ashley's a lot easier to put together. Since I've taken some of Ashley's things <laughs> home. Um, What's Ashley's from here? Uh, well. <laughs> This is Ashley's. Um, this is very Ashley, you can tell. Kind of little 80s throwback. It's, it's got the shoulder pads. Oh my god. <laughs> Speaking of dressing up in your mom's clothes, yeah, right? exactly. I remember. All shoulder pads. Oh yeah, all the time. I was like, can we take those out? <laughs> Mom, those aren't cool. So Ashley's super fashionista. Real life Amber super fashionista. Question, would you ever go into designing your own fashion? Um, I don't know. I mean, I would definitely be interested in looking into it, but I don't know if I've got that, like... Passion? As passion, or uh, like I really know what the next thing should be. You know yeah. What I mean? But I do design jewelry now with a girlfriend of mine. Oh, really? I never thought I would do that. I'm not not that into jewelry at all. Yeah. But, I, you know, I've you got a little this? collection of jewelry, but... Do you have like, examples? Uh, um, well, this is just a little one that we do uh -huh. um, right now. We're in the process of kind of getting it all manufactured. But it's like really simple stuff, and then I've got like charm bracelets and a lot of like druzy stones kind of incorporated in things. Um, and that's been really fun. It's just a small collection. I think there's like 12 items in it, and um, it should be up for sale hopefully around Christmas time. Um, it's a good time to sell things. Yeah, so you know, if <laughs> that goes things. well, who knows? Who knows what I could be doing? I could be designing shoes. You could be. That would be really amazing, actually. Speaking of designing shoes, who are your favorite designers? My favorite designers? Oh, that's a hard question. Um, let me take a look. Well, I love <laughs> Lamb, although unfortunately they're a little uncomfortable. But I do love Lamb. Um, Tom's shoes are the most comfortable shoes that I've ever worn. These are my fancy Toms. But I, you know, I got a pair of black ones that I wear all the time. And then, um, who would I say? Um, I always love, um, what's his name? This guy. <laughs> Uh, Giuseppe Zanotti. <laughs> you know, they're always really fabulous, really um, unique, yeah. very designery mm -hmm. shoes. Um, and then another favorite company that I've discovered recently is Penelope and & Coco. And they make these. Lots of Oxfords are actually what they're coming out with in their new, um, I guess, winter, fall, spring, I don't know, their new line. <laughs> um, and, but they originally started making boots, and that's why I have these and those really crazy sparkly ones. Oh, okay. They're all from this girl's company. And she just started randomly with making boots because I guess she just really liked them. And they're kind of amazing. And I've got them on right now, too. Just really comfortable. Um, kind of go with anything, but a little pizzazz, you know. Super hot. Really great. Love the studs. She's a really great shoe designer. Very cool. Okay, I'm officially jealous. You have the coolest closet ever. Well, thank you very much. <laughs> Thanks for showing it off. Of I would course. show it off too if I had this. Well, you know, I had to show someone. I, you know, just my friends have seen it. So I'm glad that you guys could come over and check it out. And I hope you liked it. I definitely liked it. And make sure you guys check out Amber Stevens when Greek returns to ABC Family this January. It's January 3rd, right? Yes, January 3rd. Yay. 9 p.m. ABC Family. ABC Family. Yeah. It's <laughs> <Yes>. awesome. <laughs>